Live, the one and only Local 10 News starts right now. Good evening. We begin with that massive screen collapse at a rolling loud stage. Just a day before, thousands are expected to pack the Hard Rock Stadium for the festival. Tonight, organizers say the show will go on. Local 10's Alex Finney is live in Miami Gardens with our top story. Alex. Well, Calvin and Eden, we know that Rolling Loud here in South Florida, first off, is a really big weekend long event. What we've also heard from Rolling, Rolling Loud organizers a little bit earlier is that they plan on having everything fixed up by tomorrow. And that includes, of course, a little bit of that collapse that we saw a bit earlier. A video wall collapsed here at Hard Rock Stadium in Miami Gardens. Sky 10 was over this, giving us a bird's eye view of the situation. Rolling Loud organizers were seen covering up the area with what looks to be a black tarp. This happening just one day before the much anticipated music festival. Rolling Loud quickly put out this statement on social media saying, in case you see it on the news, a screen fell down at one of our stages. Nobody was hurt and it will be fixed before doors open tomorrow. The show goes on. Tens of thousands of people will be heading to South Florida for the hip hop music weekend full of star studded A list performers. This is the comeback of sorts, the first Rolling Loud Miami in two years. Last year was canceled due to the pandemic. As for the situation at hand, we still don't know exactly what caused the collapse here tonight. And so to offer our viewers some perspective here, there are quite a few stages on this lot. This is not the only one. As a matter of fact, this is not that main stage that is actually much bigger than the one that you saw in that video. But nonetheless, safety is paramount throughout all of this because we know so many people are going to be here. Thankfully, in this situation, no one was hurt. For now, that's the very latest live in Miami Gardens. Alex Finney, Local 10 News. And the show will go on. Thanks. So yeah. They used to say words couldn't hurt me. Videos, just my name, they're getting thirsty. Go ahead and put them in a hearse. It's getting murky, this time I deserve this. I'm ready for whatever war said he been a matador. Stand for the dance. I'm dreaming for, I'm eating caviar. True definition of R&R, &R, revolutionary, rebel, right or wrong. Take them back when the flag was a little. Okay, so. Uh, Got my chicken, my beers. Oh, uh. oh yeah, cold old English. All right, yo. So and the old English, and the Popeye chicken with some hot sauce by that motherfucker. Cold old English. Oh, uh. You got a biscuit? I didn't get no biscuits. You ain't doing it right, bro. <laughs> oh, all right, all right. So, yo, yo, tell me what you think I should do. So, th there's basically a post that was on the No Jumper Instagram that that was like the stage at Rolling Loud collapsed, and. Yeah. I made a joke. I said, I blame Rod Wave because there was a viral clip of Rod Wave where he fucking fell through the stage, right? Like, he, he, he made well, the stage God, collapse. Damn near 555 pounds, he gonna do that. Yeah, well, <laughs> probably somewhere around there. And, and so, so I commented, I blame Rod Wave. And then Rod Wave said, uh, shut your ass, cracker. No, he didn't. Yes, he did. I'll squabble, girl. I'll fight. <laughs> Oh, neighborhood crib. <laughs> I'll be nah, we, up. we can't go right to violence, though, right? I'm trying to think of like maybe I could say something back, something funny. I could like have have some bars back at him or something. Uh, we could put the modified program. We could put we could put come bunk status pops in. What's bunk status? Just like the county jail, cause you can't get off the bunk on hood. Off yeah, do cut like a custer on hood. Oh, what? He's not gonna be able to get out of bed. No, he can't get out of bed. To get out of bed, nigga's gonna beat his ass. <laughs> oh, hood on lockdown. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy though. If we were all in prison, you and Rod Wave would have to be tight, and I would not be able to even kick it with you like that, huh? Well, you know what, Adam? We, uh, you know, you find me. We, we'll see, we'll see each other around. You find me on hood. <laughs> I'm gonna be showing love. Man, what up, everybody? It's T90 Jake. I'm rocking with y'all. Y'all rock with me. Welcome to another episode of EOS. We're going to be talking about Rolling Loud, Stage Collapse, Rod Wave, and Adam 22. July 22nd, 2021. 
with the whole entire state of Florida getting ready to come to Rolling Loud, one of the biggest events is rap can go because of coronavirus. You had the stage collapse and fall in itself, and you had news reports like I played in the beginning that talked about the stage collapsing and the show must go on. Rewind the clocks eight months ago, you can see Rod Wave in the second video walking on the stage and then collapsing. And while that stage collapsed and Rod Wave rolled back to make sure that he didn't fuck himself up, he was safe, but his crew wasn't. But it doesn't matter because Rod Wave is the bag. So Rod Wave is safe. Fast forward to July again, 2020, I mean July 22nd, 2021. A well-known guy out of Boston who came down to Los Angeles and started a podcast called No Jumper. Took a shot at Rod Wave and said that Rod Wave was the reason for the collapse at Rolling Loud. And he said, and I quote, I blame Rod Wave. Rod Wade can be seen in the comments two hours early, commenting, watch your pussy ass mouth, cracker. Now, when I think about stuff like this, I think about the repercussions of his homies. His homie, C-Mac, the 5-5 five Crip, the famous Crip Mac, C-Mac, responded. And when C-Mac responded, he responded with threats of violence and punching Rod Wave and even making himself his bunkie. Sleeping on the bottom bunk and telling him he can't get up. Now, y'all know I've been in the federal juvenile and adult penitentiary. And I can tell you that cats like Rod Wave, they would have been poked in the neck. Or they would have been poking you in the neck. But with that being said, I sit and I think, how could this all be avoided? You see, the earth. <laughs> Shout out to Oh no, I'm gonna keep it going. I'm gonna keep it going. <laughs> Shout out to 1090J. <laughs> this ain't no diss. I'm just being funny. What I think is, Adam 22, you shouldn't have said that. You see, it's enough for obese men from Florida to have motherfuckers like you talking shit about another Floridian. And for you to be white, and for me to be white, you can't say that. I speak for the gangsters of the white man. The true bloods out there that was out there rocking shit and fucking shit up. So I know how it go. No diss, no diss. I'm just fucking with y'all. I'm just playing, bro. Adam 22, what you doing, bro? That, that shit, man. I ain't gonna lie. Like, it, it was funny, but like, bro, like, Rod Wade don't seem like the type to play like that, bro. Like, you don't know jit like that. Thing. Like, I don't think cuz gonna fuck you up. And I ain't gonna lie, a fight between C Mac and Rod Wave. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, that'd be cool. Rod Wade looked like he could take a punch too. Look like you gonna hear Rod Wade, that nigga gonna laugh at you like fucking M. Bison and shit, put his hands like this and ha 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 ha. Cycle crusher, you know what I'm saying? That type of shit, bro. But I ain't, I mean, everybody don't take jokes the same, bro. And y'all, y'all gotta be careful with that shit, man. Like, you know, be knowing what a lot of these cats be doing or going through and shit like that. Rod Wade might be like, bro, fuck you. Like, what kind of whole ass shit is that? We ain't cool like that. So don't be popping jokes and all that shit. And your platform might be. One of those that he might have fucked with and he might have took that as a diss. So, honestly, you need to just go ahead and come out and be like, look, little brody, I was out here playing with you and everything like that. And that's what it was. And for y'all who about to say, man, Rod Wave, you a sensitive motherfucker, you a punk ass bitch and all that shit and everything like that. Can I ask you a question? Do you listen to Rod Wave music? You can't tell you're a little sensitive? And that's not anything bad or anything like that. Everybody can't be the tough guy. You know what I'm saying? I don't know a lot of cats that'll whoop your ass with tears in their eyes. I done seen it happen. I ain't gonna put that video up, but uh, the little black kid, 
when a little big ass little white kid came through and bullied him, and then another mother got mad and and started punching him all in his face, grabbed him, dipped him, and kept on punching him and whooping his ass. And a little white kid, like, and it ain't got nothing to do with him being white or him being black. I'm just literally giving you a description of the video. The colors don't really matter. These are two kids at the end of the day. Just, you know what I'm saying, bro? Like, everybody ain't the same, bro. All, this ain't, you know, one of them, <laughs> this ain't one of them truck stop hats type of ordeals, bro. Like, just, you know what I'm saying, my bad, my fault, bro. I ain't, we ain't cool like that and everything. Extend the olive branch and try to get them on your shit. He don't even be doing interviews and shit like that anyways. So now you know for sure you got his attention. Take advantage of this shit, but I get it. I get you being funny, but everybody ain't going to take it the same. Y'all expect me to keep it real? Because you know that I will. I do this daily, baby. You want to know how to fight back? <laughs> Simple. Just give this video a comment and a like and everything like that. Catch me on Instagram at C-E-D-D-Y-N-A-S-H, one word. That's where you and I can stay in contact. Plus, I'm going to like your pictures and all that. To the crew, that's the truth. What up with the visionaries? What, you, what, what how, how can us be going out with it? It's 1090 Jake. I'm rocking with y'all. Y'all rocking with me. But like I like to start saying, I'll catch you on the next one.